Hey, hey, y'all. Welcome back to a new episode of Rags to Riches. If you're new to my channel, please hit the sub button. Give this video a huge like so it'll help me and it'll help my channel. We can grow together as a big fam. And you're just gonna love it here. Yeah, period. Also, follow me on my socials. Y'all see them on top of the screen. All the links are in the description. And without further ado, let's move on with this episode. So I apologize. It's been two months since the last episode of Rags to Riches, y'all. Honestly, I didn't know what to do for real, for real. Or kind of been in like, uh, what is it? Like, a writer's block or something for this let's play but uh, i don't know i still don't know what to do this episode is a plan so we just gonna go with the flow but i do want ariana to ask kenzo to um move in with her and their daughter because yeah because i said in the last episode of rags to riches oh they're also watching a movie they're watching the secret life of pets too and these freaking sad bubs keep popping up and it's so annoying i don't know how to get rid of them i don't want her to be sad forever but anyways like i was saying somebody in the last episode see look <sighs> in the last episode i asked y'all if kenzo should move in and somebody commented and said of course he should because he's the one who helped her buy the house <laughs> he made them get money and everything and yeah he basically bought the house for her so it would be it would be fair if he moved in you know so that's what we're gonna do and it's late at night it's also winter and it's freezing and they're just eating fruit snacks and watching a movie on this cold winter <laughs> this cold winter night and it's also thursday so june gotta go to bed she got preschool in the morning this is so toddler them standing in front of the tv this is such a toddler thing my niece used to do this <laughs> she's eight now but when she was little yeah she used to do this oh it's so cute here june i think she has another fruit snack i'm gonna let her eat this other one she gonna be hope you're gonna be able to go to sleep girl all this sugar and your mom just gonna leave you like okay is she about to wash the the wrapper in the sink please the sims this is the sims for you like come on y'all y'all keep seeing me exit these buffs out it's because she just keeps being sad and i don't know how to get rid of that it's that one particular is this one particular buff that keeps coming back it's driving me insane oh ariana clean this up and we're about to send june to bed Oh, no, she just sunk into the couch. Please. She's so adorable. But yeah, that last episode was so cute, y'all. They went out on the beach and everything. I did my thing. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Jada, wait a son. He be like, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, anyways. Let's put her to bed. Yeah, she's tired. Junie. Come on, baby. Why was I just about to go upstairs where her bed is? Oh, she should read her to sleep. Maybe that'll make you and your daughter happy. Well, really you, because your daughter's happy. You just keep being sad, and I'm so sick of doing this. I'm just about to let you be a sad bitch. This is crazy. Like, three, two, one. Look. <laughs> I knew it. I just knew it. Oh, we should have had to watch a comedy movie. She wanted to watch a comedy movie. Oh, well. Maybe next time. But yeah, she's reading her daughter to sleep. With tears in her eyes for no apparent reason. Maybe it's because she's still sad about her mama and, you know, her just needing to run away. Well, not really. She she technically did run away. Her mama not really being there for her and stuff throughout her life. Y'all know in the first episode, that whole machinima thing, when she, um to her mama she was taking june and they were like leaving yeah she was gonna better herself and do what she needed to do to take care of her and her daughter and that's what she's doing and you see she aced it she got a whole house thanks to her boo they living good living great and we are striving to succeed in her career as a private chef that's what she wants to do so yeah i think she's just still sad about the whole mother and daughter situation but i'll see y'all when they get up please bought pancake stinks really amber like i don't give a f this girl wakes up sad like this is so crazy look at i just can't bro oh my gosh bad gossip Ariana feels icky after receiving that phone call about the town gossip my baby needs to get up she has preschool soon oh i didn't even know she aced these skills oh she's almost about to know how to walk good but my girl she she know how to walk good already you know we're gonna make her some breakfast we'll make them some breakfast actually another thing i want to do i want to have her sell like some pizza and waffles on that 
thing in my blob. But she gonna make some breakfast. My girl is a level five cooker, period, on a mad hoe. Mm-hmm. And she's only a teen, so she gonna be level 10 before she's a, a young adult. Or an adult at that. Yeah. Don't play with Ariana. She is not one of them. I told you, she wants to become a private chef, and she is, she's hustling. She's really hustling. French toast, bacon, and cheesy. Ooh. Let's do this. She's tense because she's worried about her health. As long as she's not sad, I don't care. That sad shit is just pissing me off, for real. These damn tears in her eyes, bro. <laughs> is my baby still asleep? Yeah, she'll be up pretty soon. Oh, she's not even hungry. I guess we could just send her off to preschool. Yeah, oh, these eggs is nasty. We gotta clean that up. But yeah, i kind of been like on a creator's block or writer's block, whatever you call it. So I haven't been knowing what to do with this Let's Play for real. At least for right now. Ooh, I like how the grease is like... Oh my gosh, hold on, QMBB. The details, the grease. Come on now. Ooh, that look good. And she would put it in the sink. Feeling a bit lost, please, a friend. This is 6 o'clock a.m. I can't go nowhere. Anyway, I got a child at home. Until my boyfriend move in. So he could start like watching her. We could start going out and shit. <laughs> yeah. But I'm gonna have her eat. But yeah, yeah, I haven't really been knowing what to do. I just want y'all to start giving me like recommendations or, you know, opinions on what to do and stuff. I would love that. But like when she become a young adult, I feel like that's when this list is really gonna start popping. This TV been on all night, girl. Yo, light bill finna be high. I'ma turn it off. Oh, you know what? Yep. Get up, girl. Look, her needs are perfect. She don't need to eat or nothing. It's probably because she ate those fruit snacks last night. It filled her up. She is contemplating about going to preschool. She's like, uh, should I go? Is mommy gonna make me go? <laughs> oh, her diaper stinks. Dang. My baby about to go to school in a nasty diaper. No, I gave her a new outfit. Hold on. Change. No, I'm just doing it. MC Command Center. Look, look, y'all. Look at, look, please, please. Look at this little girl. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. She is so adorable. Oh my gosh, yes. Definitely had to get a cute picture of you. Bye, my baby. Wait, I want to get another cute picture of you in a um, in a light. We need to take like professional photos of June. I think we're gonna do that in one episode. She is so cute. And okay, so we gonna get ready. Since our daughter's at school, well, she don't really need to take a shower or nothing. I'm gonna just have her change it to her clothes so we can get started on this food sale, I guess you could call it. Should she change it to this or is it, this might be too cold. She's a badass fucking bitch. Let me turn this off. Let's go out here and let's start cooking these waffles. I'm gonna do chicken and waffles and this pizza. I think she might need to put on her outdoor wear since it's um snowing. Ooh, pizza caliente. Why does that look good? And I think she's gonna be cold. Watch. Oh no, I thought the buff would have came. Y'all, I apologize if this episode is gonna be boring. Oh my god. I just hope this episode is not gonna be boring. I really hope not. I'm really just going with the flow. But next episode, I promise I'm gonna try to make it better. Not even try. I am. Yeah, she might need to put on her. Oh no, she good. Oh, I'm growing too fast. Oh yeah, yep. Look, the buff just came up. Yeah, let me have her change it to her cold weather outfits. These are ready. I think this is like my second time playing with this Home Chef Hustle thing. I'm gonna make some more. We're gonna make, ooh, apple bacon waffles, yeah. This is pretty fun though. I like this thing. Oh look, look at Cedric. <laughs> I had seen a food truck override of this. I should get it. I think I'm gonna get it. We're gonna make another pizza. Let's just do the regular classic pepperoni. Mmm, delicioso. That looks so good. Mm, 
Look, my girl is a chef. Please, like we do not need our mama. We can do all this on our own and we can conquer and succeed. Look at her being a mother, a chef, and a girlfriend all in one. Mm hmm. Can't tell her Nate Daniels. But, anyways, let's put this stuff in here. And we're gonna wait till this pizza is done. Oh, her boot calling her. Do you think it's rude to text someone late at night? What's the ladies? Who the fuck is you texting, first of all? You better be talking about me. He better be talking about me. Kenzo, don't play with me. Please don't play with me. Why would you ask me, is it rude to text someone late at night? Who are you texting other than me? It better be either your homeboys or me. That's all I'm gonna say. I should give no response. I'm gonna do a no response. I hope your day gets better, Ariana. No need for negativity. No, because who the fuck are, Like, what? Hello? Right. That's the same face I'm making. Because who are you texting other than me? Better be your mama, your sister, your little brother, because he do got all of them in the family, or his friends. Because what? Why are you texting somebody late at night at that? But okay, these pizzas are ready, so I guess we can start the food sale. Change business details. Ariana, I'm going to just say Ariana's Cuisines. Boom, and then start food sale. It's too early to be eating pizza, but hey, we got breakfast. Come on, get your breakfast. Let's see who all comes. And then when we're like completely done with this, we're gonna go to Kenzo's house and we're gonna ask him if he wants to move in. I think she can do that. I'm not sure. Oh, she's thinking about her baby. So story to do. Ding dong ditch. Kiss someone. Oh, yep, she gonna kiss her man. Pin that. I think it's because it's too early, Ariana. Maybe I shouldn't have. Oh, look. Zoe's dad and her mama came. Okay. Zoe's dad and her mama came. We should meet them. Let's meet them. Can she talk to them? I don't, I don't know. Oh, yay. She's fully developed her movement skill. Amazing. He coming, he coming off the bike. I peep you. Mm-hmm. I know that's right. The parents come in. Look at Khalil. Um, hello? This is my food. Yo. Devin. Devin. If you... This man said he didn't want my food. He wouldn't cook his own. Okay. That's all you could have said. That's mad disrespectful. I love how all my sims are coming and not the townies. Oh, look. This is Kenzo's dad. Yeah. Oh, my God. She don't know Kenzo's dad. This her um boyfriend's dad. What the fuck? I didn't know she didn't know him. Let me uh, meet my man's dad, I guess. We're going to pretend that they already knew each other. They just ain't seen each other in a little while, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> now she know Khalil. Please. I wonder what sentiment she got with Khalil. I don't think they have a sentiment. Khalil is a bop, y'all. If y'all watch my Mostly Scar and Black Mafia. Mm -hmm. This man don't got no clothes on. It's me not um not finished dressing him. That's that's really the problem. <laughs> what are you taking a picture of, Khalil? Oh, her man here. My bae. Hold on, y'all. Y'all gonna have to, um, yeah. Oh, Khalil. 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 Where my man at? He just pulled up, hold on, I'm gonna have Kenzo uh, say some words to Khalil, cause what the, f he pulled up right on time too, he seen that, he seen that, let me control him real quick, please, like, what, he gonna slap him, <laughs> he gonna slap him, Kenzo don't play about his wife, M my wife, you talking about my wife, you talking about this girl right here, my wife, you talking about my wife, inside, inside my house that I paid for, now her bitch ass daddy nigga, yeah, he don't play about his wife. He said, hey man, I heard you shouting at my girl. You better talk nice. Yeah. He became good friends by slapping him. What the heck? Wait, 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 come here. Kiss your girl. You just gonna come over here and not say nothing? Or not do nothing? Ooh, he could propose to her. Let me, ooh, kiss in the snow. I never seen that interaction. Somebody calling her. 
heart um sister hey fam want to get together and hang out somewhere today let's get out of the house yeah it's not a good time sis they ate all my waffles yes that's what i'm talking about what he thinking about feeling great from slapping someone well that felt great they totally deserved it they sure did khalil sure did dang no because oh never mind here you go the first npc Devin, what are you doing behind the counter? Who is this? I heard, who who is this? Oh, this is champagne. Clip, yo, yo, I'm about to hold on. Clip got me fucked up. I'ma threaten him. Like either you gonna buy some food or I'ma call the cops. Cause you being rude for no reason, sir. Hey. Oh, he just shoved. <gasps> Oh my god. Y'all, what's up, bro? Kenzo, we really was gonna come over there to um, ask you a question. But you wanted to pop up over here. Ah, look, he jealous. Is it? Oh, he might like her. Maybe. Y'all know what they say. When niggas be uh, mean to you, they bully you. That means they like you. Mm, see? He thinking about her. Oh. Oh. Clue is such a hoe. He really is. I wouldn't even be surprised. She's supposed to be. Hold on. She's supposed to be. Um. This girl's supposed to be selling stuff. And she over here flirting with her man in front of everybody. Yeah. Let me convince the bar. Oh. What did? Tell the leap into arms. Oh my god. Let me stop controlling him. I just wanted to control him so he could slap Clue. And let him know who to keep talking to. Who the? Oh my god. She's. She's naked. This is Anaya? Yo, what? Uh, this man? Yeah, please go. Kenzo, your dad. You ain't even talk to your dad. Oh, yep. It's done. Y'all can leave. Disable auto stop. How I, um, how I end this? Oh, no, I didn't want to clear it. I'm just trying to end this. Oh, did I should really get going now. Did he just flirt with me? Um, Kenzo, did your dad just flirt with me? Oh. <gasps> Um, is this Regina? Who is this? Oh, this Crystal. Ariana do need some friends. Even though she like a teen, we just don't make friends with the older girls. Let's say hey to her. But I think we done. Like, everything's gone. Y'all bought all my shit up. Let's make friends with Champagne, too. Ew. That was so nasty. Look at them. They still over here. Where, um, Kenzo at? I hope he went back home because we about to go over there real... <gasps> Oh my gosh, Devin! Let me revive him. No way! No, 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 no! Oh, her sister's here. Joy, get your man's. Devin, get out the. Let me control him. Why are you even in the water? Like, have some sense. What are you doing? Who knew dunking yourself into freezing water could feel so... <sighs> nah, it's dumb. What do you mean? Wait, Devin lost some weight. Boy, you been in the gym, y'all. He had a stomach. Oh my God, this man look fit. I think Devin been in the gym. Yeah, please go home. Like, who told you to get in my pool anyway? Wait, where's my sister? Oh, no, 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 Autumn. Come here, come here, come here, come here, sis. Sis, I didn't even know you was here. Let me give her a hug and then she can leave. Hug lovingly. Y'all can go. I'm gonna send Kezo home because we about to go to we about to pop up at his house anyway. After I give my sister a hug. June's still not home from school. Oh, look, right when I said that. <laughs> how ironic. June, no no no. Put your clothes, put your um yeah. Cause I do not want you to freeze. And we need to change her diaper. Let me pick up my baby. Look, there go dada. <laughs> look at dada. No, let me stop. <laughs> The principal. <laughs> hey, sis. Hey, Autumn. Let me change my chat. Who was in here? The Grim Reaper in here watching my TV. Grim, clock out for me, my boy. You ain't even have to come over here. Ew, look at the Grim Reaper's hands. I never seen his hands. I never really paid attention to his hands, actually. They so wrinkly. Oh, my God, Grim. You need a freaking hand massage. You need some lotion. You just need a lot of shit for your, uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at my Junie baby. We about to go see Dad Dad Boo. Mm -hmm. Even though he was just over here. 
But he ain't really seen you for real, so yeah, we about to go see that dad. And we're gonna ask him something. But before we head over there, I went to order some edible arrangements. Shout out to QMBB for the edible arrangements. Wait, it's not that. It's the catering co edible arrangements. And we're gonna surprise him with this. Ooh, let's get this one. And is she hungry? Oh no, you are straight. We ain't really been having to take care of her because her knees been up this whole episode. Oh look, I should really get going now. Oh, Neve. Ariana, watch some TV so your needs can watch the Cartoon Network. So her fun can go up. And I'm gonna have June come talk to her mommy. Oh, ask to play, ask for dessert. Let's talk about princesses. My girl can walk now, yay, look at her. She is so, oh, she's thinking about her aunt. Be funny with Autumn, hmm. Yep, there go, um, there go my, there go my edible arrangements. Do you wanna go out on a date? Stop, we wish, oh, this is perfect, yes. Oh, my edible arrangements though, yes. He taking me to Benny Harness, hold on y'all, this was not, I mean obviously y'all can see this was not play. okay. I don't know who gonna take my baby, but I mean shit, fuck it, yeah, we can ask him to move in during a day. This literally came at the perfect time. And I just reordered the edible arrangements. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Well, I'll see y'all at the date. Oh my God, my man took me to Benny Harness, what? Kento, a big baller. And I was just saying, I don't want this episode to be boring. And honestly, it's not turning out boring. That's why you just have to play and go with the flow. The thing is, I might have to change these tables real quick, y'all. Because I don't think I can. Yeah, I can't request the table. So I BRB real quick. So we going inside. And this bitch is still sad. Who is the host? Oh, dang. That girl knocked up. Nancy knocked up. Are you the host? Who the hoes? There we go. Oh, no, no, no. Let me have my man request. Where is he? Kenzo, what the? Here, re request the table. And we just gonna stand over here looking pretty. I just hope this works. I don't know. Y'all, I haven't played here yet. This is my first time. So I really hope this works. I'm not sh No, 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 not you. Is it working? I don't think this is working. Oh, we got Lotto in here. Oh, yeah, this is Benny Hanna's for real. We got the celebs. Oh, look, Travis and his family. Are they watching TV on this little... Pfft, I didn't even know this was a TV. They... <laughs> no, that's pretty funny. Oh, those chairs do work. Look at her. Please, you're supposed to be working. What are you doing? And who food is this? Y'all giving us a, a free sample or something? Because I'll take it. Hold on, let me take this. <laughs> Should I do that? No, 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 no. I'm not going to do it. Y'all don't mind these chairs. I ain't feel like changing them. But I did add these tables and these chairs because I thought these high chairs wasn't going to work. But they do. Look! Oh, we got sexy red in this bitch! Ah! Get it sexy. Get it sexy. Let's order for table. Dag Dag, Jermise. Boy, you know this is super fit. I like. <laughs> oh, they both gonna get a mimosa. Mm hmm. Cause, yo, why not? Oh, this seafood shit look good. I'm gonna have Kenzo get this and Ariana gonna get some sushi. I wish she could get two. Oh, actually, she could get two. We're gonna take this other person. I don't know whose sushi this is, but I'm taking. Oh, this Lottos? Oh my god, Big Lotto sitting with us. Ah! Oh, we gotta beat Big Lotto. What the? We got Big Lotto at our table. What up? Let me ask for an autograph and ask for a selfie. My man really took me to Benihana's. And we got celebrities here. He the shit. My man the shit. Um, you couldn't finish taking off your, your mask at home? Your face mask? I guess he didn't have time. He was probably rushing off the door. Being late for work. Oh, my sister calling me. Oh, uh, uh, I'm out with my man at Benihana's with celebrities. Um, sister, we can do that another time. Oh. How much they dislike you? Lotto, you too popping for that. Get off the flow, sis. Oh, maybe that's why she named the song. Put it on the flow. Let me stop. Oh, my man flirting with me. Y'all, this is so cute. What the? We on a date at Benny Hanna's, bitch. And the music is a vibe. You digging my style. <laughs> Look, they back on good terms because they was just kind of like 
somewhat beefing all because you know she left with their daughter and they was kind of like in an abandoned house and well they was in an abandoned house and Kenzo was not with it he was not with that shit so he was really yeah that man was really upset for a while about that about his daughter and Ariana being in an abandoned house with no windows I love you she like, babe, I love you so much. What the heck? I have no money to take myself to Benny Hannes, but you, you broke me here. My man, my man, my man. Ooh, and our food here. Let's blow him a kiss. And we sit with Big. Oh, never mind. We ain't sit with Big Lotto. Oh, we got Dirk Dreamer here. Sexy Red still here. Should have took off her glasses. Who is this? Ice Spice here. Oh my God, Ice Spice. You thought I was feeling you? Who else? Joy here. We got Ruby Rose. India Rowell. Um, Yasmin here. Yasmin, where is your parents? I just seen Travis and Tasha. Your mama all the way in here, Yasmin. Oh my god, we got Ari Fletcher in here. Oh, it's popping in here, y'all. And our food is here, yes. No, because we was really about to steal Big Lotto's food. I'm glad we didn't. Wait, do she know her? Let me cheat her um stuff. Oh, yeah, I have to have her ask him if he wants to move in. Look, look at these buffs. Keep it up, player, from Digging Sim. As much as I know his sugar ain't shit, I still might let him hit. Please stop. <laughs> happy in love feels good to make someone happy, and especially someone I love. Oh, she got the she got the bubble guts. This girl got to take a sh. She feel queasy. Well, I guess it's a goodbye. Um, Don't call me ever. Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> Dude, I was just sitting here reading the buffs, and then this just pops up. Yo, what the fuck just happened? Everything was just going good, and then I read the buffs, and then that notification just pops up. Ask to go to couple counseling. No, y'all was just... I am so confused. Let's see if they can get back on good terms. Because what in the heck? Let's sweet talk him. And where is her skin? Hold on, who food is it? Oh, he's just cleaning up. Well, dang, I thought we was gonna ask him if he wanted to move in, but the freaking romance meter then went down for no reason. Did they have a sentiment? No, I don't know what just happened. That's really, that's really weird. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, ask the joint household, there we go. She can't ask him. She's like, bae, so I'm glad we're here. Do you wanna move in with me? He like, yeah, mamas, of course. Ooh! He's in the household. Oh my gosh. Kenzo is officially living with Ariana and their daughter. Yay. Ariana, you didn't even eat. Eat your sushi. Oh, look. He feeling his sail. Look at him. He happy. Look at this man. Come on, Kenzo. No. No, no, no. What are you doing? What are you doing? Who over here? Why are they all? I'm about to touch. Y'all, watch. Watch this. Yeah, go. Sit down, eat, do something. Oh, we got Chris Breezy in here. See, Breezy. Oh, look at him. So I guess Benny Hanna's was a W. Look at uh Drayden. Why is everybody... Oh, we got Young... Hold on, Kenzo. Look, I know my nigga here, but Young Boy here too. We done spotted Young Boy. What the... Oh, wait, she know him? Wait, she know... Oh, I was about to say. She drunk. They drunk off that one mimosa. Dang. She's like, babe, I gotta use the bathroom real quick. The whole time she trying to um, yeah, go get young boy autograph. Really? Oh, can I at least get a selfie? Okay, this bitch still dancing. Somebody need to fire her. Thank you, young boy. Oh my god. <laughs> We should meet Ari Fletcher too. Attempt introduction. Finally, concrete proof celebrities exist in the world. Well, we gonna give up the table. We gonna pay in mill. Eighty two dollars at Benny Hanna's. Dang, that's cheap. He like, dang, that took a long time. Look, they about to go. We're done eating. Yeah, we done. Wait, where's she going? They didn't turn this TV back on. I'm crying. Look at the land grabs. Stinking ass land grabs. Literally. She stank. Drayden, really? You came out the closet? It is Pride Month. I guess. Alright, we going home. We home, y'all.
And I just seen the edible arrangements on the front porch, but I put it on the table. So she's about to come unpack this. No, 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 Kenzo, I want her to surprise you. Wait, 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 wait. Actually, you can go in. Yeah, you know what? He can go in. Girl, come on. She's like, so, babe, we're going to have dessert. And for dessert, I ordered some edible arrangements. She's like, here it is. She's like, this is for us. Moving in together, so I'm super happy, and this is what she surprised him with. This girl just keeps surprising him. Like, W girl. W freaking girl. And I'm gonna have them... June, come get you some too, baby. Even though she probably not even hungry. Are you gonna get something, Kenzo? You gonna get it? You gonna get a... Yeah, take a slice. Not they eat it as a little family. Oh my god, wait, this is so adorable. She's so in love. This is really her man, her man, her man. I didn't name that last episode that name for no reason, y'all. This is really her man, her man, her man. Um, this is glitching. I don't know. But yeah, they had a good day today. That was a very unexpected date. But it went very well. And I'm so happy for them. We gonna have him flirt with her. I'm still not understanding why the romance meter went all the way down, but we're going to fix that. We definitely going to fix that. Maybe they should go to couple counseling. <laughs> they still got some hidden beef or whatever. Not beef, but, you know, some problems in their relationship. They, they need to fix. Do you love me? Yeah, this is not working for June. I don't know why. I'm going to just reset her. Well, June, you could just eat another fruit snack, I guess. Your mommy has them in her thing. Oh, she can't give it to her? Why? I did it last time. Oh, I don't know why she can't give them to June. I'm gonna just have her go to bed. You know what? I'm gonna have her daddy put her to sleep. Put June to bed. And we're gonna put this in the refrigerator. Put the rest of this away. And everybody's gonna go to bed, y'all. Oh, she is tired and she stink. Here, clean up. No, I'm gonna have Kenzo clean up. He's the man. The show house now, Kenzo. Well, it been his house. He technically bought it. <laughs> technically, if you think about it. He really just helped her, for real, for real. This man had to change his clothes just to dump Just to dump it out. Oh, no, he didn't. Ooh, Benny Hanna's got your stomach rumbling. Oh, food poison. Oh, we are never going back to Benihana's. Look, it was a good experience, but, baby, we got food poisoning. Uh-uh, let me call them up. They got me fucked up. Yeah, report food poisoning. Let me get my money back. I'm about to die over here. Uh-uh. Try to take my woman on a date, and then I come back with food poisoning. What'd that say? We're taking Kenzo's claim of food poisoning very seriously. Please accept $102 as compensation for our mistake. Try drinking lots of water. I'm gonna have him drink some water. Boy, didn't you just go use the bathroom? Yeah, give me my money back. We basically ate there for free. <laughs> the bill was $82, so we got more than what we paid for. Damn, Kenzo. Oh, no. I was just about to have you go. Go to bed. Just go to bed. Go to bed. You'll sleep the food poison off. Where is Ariana? This girl done took... Y'all need to go to sleep. Y'all can do all of this in the morning. Damn, this girl has a hangover off one mimosa. Dang, he feel better that quick. Survive food poisoning. Well, all right, y'all. That is the end of... I don't even know what number episode we on, but that is the end of this episode. It turned out pretty good. I was really saying, I hope this episode is not going to be boring, but it turned out amazing. W date, kind of. My man got food poisoning, but he survived this. So yeah, W date. W girl, she surprised him with edible arrangements. She asked him to move in. They are officially living together and I am so excited for them. In the next episode, we got to get their romance meter back up. So if y'all enjoyed it, please give this a huge like, comment down below and subscribe and I'll see y'all in my next episode. So, bye. They both stank.